been seeing a lot of videos of clients refusing to pay their hairstylist and at this point it's become too many to ignore so i decided to react to them let's begin with this one it says she was on the phone and she told whoever she was talking to that she couldn't pay me I have a few questions like what happens did you have a follow-up like kind of conversation with the person after they were done with the conversation or you just heard on the phone and decided oh no <laughs> because some people are like that they really like they will not even try to find out whether something is true i'm not saying you the girl the benefit of the doubt or what that's something serious if you hear something like that i also want to hear from her what is really happening and that is what i would do but I'm wondering whether she just hid that on the phone and decided right away to cut. Was she even aware that she was cutting to begin with? Like, did she know that her hair is being cut? Is the question. Also, you know how how, how painful follows can be? Imagine somebody putting in follows and then afterwards, literally removing them. You have to wait about, anyway, it depends on the breeder. Sometimes... They can be loose enough. Sometimes they can, most times they are actually quite painful and also very tight. So imagine if they are that tight and somebody cuts them the same day. You're not even done. She has a few bits of like her own hair that is not yet braided. I want to know whether or not she was like, was there a follow-up conversation is what I want to know because... Also, like, how do you just sit in somebody's chair and decide you're not going to pay them after the words started working? Like, shouldn't you have had that discussion before the whole thing? Like, why are we having this session now that I've already started working? Both sides could be problematic, is all I'm saying. But we don't know. So we're just going to move on to the next one. So this one says, girl tried to run out without pain. Wow. But how am I going to pay you if the service is not Because done? you That's have a thing. nasty attitude and I'm no, not going to continue. No, this is personal. You were Boy, late. This is not business. Okay, you were this late personal, at 901. It's if personal because this is my studio. If you were so if you are not you going to pay me, I'm not going to I'm finish your hair. Listen, I'm not going to argue. If you could just So pay. I'm not going to finish your hair. You have to pay me first. Okay, how much do you want? I'm, I'll give you... a part of it but i'm not gonna give you all of it until it's done how much yeah okay so you can pay i think that's reasonable to just wait until it's done why can't she just wait until it's done like she's not refusing according to what she's saying at least she's not refusing to pay the full amount she's just refusing to pay right then until it's done so why not just finish it and then give her the money after you can pay me 150 and i'll finish your hair no, I can't pay you one Okay, ma'am. Oh. Now I see what the problem is. She doesn't want to pay the full amount. So she's. I think she's just hoping she finishes and then she pays whatever she has. Oh, so get up and go where you're going. Let me let me take these out because I'm not gonna. <laughs> can you just finish the hair so I can pay go? me, girl? You, started, you have to pay me. I don't care what you got work. going on. You have a nasty attitude, so and you, I'm not on that. How are you gonna start? Are you gonna start the hair and not finish? Like I said, I'm gonna take your hair out, and or you can go. I'm not. I'm not finna play with you like that. Period. Period. I'm different about my money. Are you gonna pay me? You already started. How am I gonna so pay, you pay you me then? That is not finished. So that pay me. Finished. You can pay me you, 150 you and I will finish your hair. I don't care what I did. You had the you. you got two feet, you can get up and they, walk out. They didn't pay you. I, these people I know. It doesn't matter. These are my family. Okay, what you can do though, you can pay me. No, I'm not gonna pay Okay, so let's go ahead and take I'm these out. I'm not gonna pay what is happening again it's like the same thing like why aren't you having these agreements before you even begin to touch each other's hair why are we not having these agreements before we sit down like why are you not agreeing on the price first before you sit down it's really frustrating because if i'm a brother it will be frustrating because i've already spent this time starting to do this unless she didn't also communicate then that would be a problem. If she didn't communicate and just decided on the price while doing it, that would be a problem. 
But then again, like, why is this a thing? Like, shouldn't you have agreed on this before you do anything? It's like something with that first one. I don't even know what's going on anymore. I'm just going to go and see the next one because I don't know what is happening. I want it to be over and done with. So this one says, woman can't pay her hairdresser. Look what happens next. And don't worry about your hair. I do it. Call the police. I do have many of us. Call the police. You want to give me a Call the police. You are you people are wicked. Even though she's my friend. Call the police. You are wicked people. I do get that one. Wish. Nah, nah, the girl I cut off the girl here, just sit down here, that's the rule. I'm African born, I got this. Let's have all the police. So my girl is sitting on the chair, man, the girl I cut off the ear. So we know, we know, if my girl, you couldn't cut off my blood clot, yeah, I will have blood clot. You don't want to pay. She was really, really angry. And I don't know why she said something about her being a friend. And it's like she's really ripping through that hair, trying to cut it, because you can see her holding on, trying to make sure that it, I don't know. Also, like, don't you know people to offend in this life? Why would you want to offend an African woman that is trying to make money? Do you love your life? Ah, uh, guys, no, please. <laughs> Me, I don't think I'm a problematic person, but if I chose a day to be problematic, it wouldn't be this day. It wouldn't be this day in this woman's salon. That I know for sure. Do you not see people and just decide whether or not you want to be behave? Please, read the room, the people, the situation. Because if this woman told me a price that is ridiculous, I would probably just like make a payment plan or something like that because I don't want chaos in my life. Not like this. This is too much. Again, we don't know what happened whether or not she just refused the pay or she was told a different price. They should come up with a prior to this kind of story so that we know exactly what's happening because we're just in the middle. It's like we just find people cutting all of a sudden. Tell us what happened before this. What's... We need to catch up. Ah. Come back. Good morning, everybody. So this one says instant karma. Karen goes back to the hair salon and does crazy things. Then walk of shame. Okay, let's see what Karen does. Before we start, that lady shall never pay for that. Huh? I'm for you to prepay for your hair. I don't know how you're gonna do my hair. I ain't got a problem. They know how already they're like, that's that girl that comes in here and doesn't pay for anything. And the other lady's like, you need to pay for your hair. Like, prepay for it before you sit down. Yeah. I feel like if you have an agreement and they know what the price is, some people you just need to make them prepay. But then they go and feel they don't like the hair. Hmm. Maybe it should be flexible to give a refund. Anyway, let's see. You gonna do my hair? I ain't got a prepay. Yes, you do. No, I didn't. Last time you didn't pay. No, but I ended up uh, working a deal out with you, and you got your money. So no, I, I, I didn't get paying nothing. Well, let's see, prepay. I know you got it. Where's that prepay that you had? How much is it to the? I, I had to sell that bag because I didn't have enough money. It's sixty. It's still gonna be sixty. Mm -hmm. Do you ever have any kind of? Is a holiday special or anything? Wait. Why is she asking? Is it still going to be 60? Like, so she probably wants to get the same hair that she did last time. And now she's thinking, I don't know, she's thinking it's cheaper now. I don't, why? Why would she think that? Who told Karen that it's cheaper this time? Anyway, let's see if she works out a payment plan deal. No specials, honey. No specials. Hey, hey, Kelly, she can't be talking to the customers like she that. She's already asking the lady for some money. Yeah. Again. Why are you there? I don't know. If you know what the price was the last time and you can't even afford to come with at least a minimum of that much, why are you there? Because it's not like you don't know, you know. So why are you there? This moment is crazy. She 
asking her for money, right? You you can't do that. She can't do that, Kelly. Yeah. Stop asking everybody for money. Excuse me. Well, you leave my lady alone. She's relaxing. You don't have no money. Again, oh, I got I got I got some money right here. I got Okay, what can I get for twenty one dollars? Right, she got twenty one dollars. What can I get for twenty one dollars? Kelly, you, it's up to you. She got it. Go just forget it. I got a... Okay, well. Don't come back. Don't come back. What is happening? Why? She didn't come with half of it. She came with 21. Why? And I understand that is a lot of money here. But if you know the price of what it is there, why would you and children come with at least more than half? She didn't even come with half. What is happening? Like, who is the problem? Are the stylists the problem? What is happening? This one was just clearly, it was her. If I, I really hope this wasn't real because it's really funny, but not funny. Because how do you walk into a hair salon without the amount that you need, knowing fully well what it's going to cost, not even going there with half of the amount? What are you doing? What are we doing? Leave these people alone if you're not able to pay them. Go and watch a YouTube video and try to learn how to do that. <sighs> anyway, I am done here. This last one, this last one, mm -mm, no. What? Bye.